Hey Siri, what should everyone do while watching my video? Hit the subscribe button and the bell next to AJ170's name so you never miss a video. Hey guys, what is up? This is AJ170 and today guys, I'm going to be doing another jailbreak video guys. Now, <clears throat> This is something that's really simple to do. You just do a repo, install two different tweaks, bada bing, bada boom, you're done. It, you could be done within a minute. Really easy, really simple to do. And what this will do is it will make the cells inside of your settings app round. And if you don't know what that means, those little white rectangular thingy majiggers that you can push with your fingers to go to another category. For example, they will say general, wallpaper, stuff like that. Instead of them reaching all the way to over to the screen, there will be a few centimeters of space and they'll be rounded. Now, a few people have predicted that this is what it will look like in iOS 12, and even in concept themes, they've this tweak has been featured in it. So I wanted to make a little video to teach you guys how to get it. Now, this supports iOS 9, iOS 10, and iOS 11. It is all jailbreak versions that are jailbreakable on those versions. And no, I will not be teaching you guys how to jailbreak your iOS version. And if you guys want nothing but iOS tutorials, the top three YouTubers for iOS jailbreak videos would definitely have to be The Jailbreaker, Brandon Butch, and iReviews. Those are probably the top three people you're going to want to go to for jailbreak related videos. Those are the three people I go to. So with all that said, can I get 170 likes? Also, if you guys are new, support the 170 and subscribe. So with all that said, let's go ahead and jump right into this video. I'm going to go ahead and meet you guys over on my iPhone now. All right, so as you guys can see, I'm clearly on my iPhone now. So the first, this is what it looks like right here. As you can see, it adds that nice round effect. Now, a downside of it is it does have the little blue thing of general selected, but all you have to do is tap something else and it will go away. And just about everything is supported too. The only thing I've seen that doesn't do it if you, if you have Eclipse and you go to Enabled Applications, it still looks normal. Now, I don't know why that is. It could just be a thing with Eclipse using different types of cells. I have no idea. But as you can see, even if I go under iPhone Storage, it is still there and selected, all nice and perfect. Same thing under Wi-Fi settings, doesn't do it there either, don't know why, I think those are probably the only two options, and possibly Bluetooth, I can't remember. So, what you're going to do is go ahead, go to City, and you're going to add the repo inside of the description. This is the official repo to get Flex. If you guys have Flex, then you can fast forward the video until I close out of City. But if you guys don't have it... All you're going to have to do is get a repo called getdelta.co. I believe I got that correctly. Yes, I did. Again, it will be linked inside of the description, so do not worry. And then you're going to install the Flex 3 beta. If you guys are on iOS 9, I'm guessing you would download Flex 2.5. Then, then all you guys would have to do is from here, install it. Flex is free. There is a trial version of it you get. The first time you use it, you can install up to two tweaks. And then after you do that, you're limited to one a day. So if you guys already used your one a day, just wait until tomorrow. So here's the iOS 12 concept for iOS 11. I will be showing you guys all different versions. So you're going to see a cloud icon. It should be the middle option on the bottom. Go ahead and tap that. Then go to the search, type in concept, and hit search. The first one that says iOS 12 concept UI theme is for iOS 11. The second one that says iOS 10 in parentheses is clearly for iOS 10. And then the third one that says iOS 9 is clearly for iOS 9. Again, iOS 12 concept UI theme that just says that is for iOS 11. iOS 12 concept UI theme, iOS 10 in parentheses, is for if you're on an iOS 10 jailbroken device. iOS 12 concept UI theme, iOS 9 in parentheses, is for iOS 9. It's pretty simple. Once you guys install it, go back to where your things are, which is, should be the first option on the bottom. Enable the tweak. If it does not show up, all you have to do is respring, and then there you go. It will eventually show up in here. All pretty easy to do. I don't think this is really too complicated for you guys yet. But uh, yeah, that is basically going to be just about it for this video, guys. This is AJ170 signing out. See you guys next time.